Hello there, buggers! Well, I saw this little bottle, and today it will be precision work. So first we start off with gravel. On a scale this tiny, I just use aquarium gravel. And second, bioactive soil. And here I found some moss in the garden. Just make sure you clean it well with water. The same for this tiny garden plant. So, we got the recipes, let's cook with nature. I will use this funnel and hope I keep it clean. And put my materials, which are basic, to good use. Cause it's all about being creative, isn't it? So, first we start off with the gravel, which is basically aquarium gravel. Just make sure you clean it well. And also don't use too much. Only a layer to cover the bottom will be enough. Cause we need to have space for the second layer. And the second layer will be bioactive soil. This soil comes from the garden shop cause it's mixed with fertilizer. But you can also use forest ground. At this point I still kept it clean. And cleaning the glass is a hell of a job. But I use this ear stick to reach the small angles. I took this tiny piece of moss out of the garden, hoping it will fit. So let's gently press it inside. For this I use my Pro Tool a tree branch. and pressing the moss against the surface. And here we go with the cleaning again. And last but at least the tiny garden plant. I really don't know what species of plant this is, but it will fit. I hope so. So let's gently push it down the bottle. And hope the tree branch doesn't break. Just make sure you put the roots of the plant deep in the soil. And while I was searching in the garden I also found this Armadillidium vulgare. This isopel species is also called common pill bug or potato bug. Well, let's put them in. And I leave you guys with some footage of the finish. So guys, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, don't forget to like and subscribe and I see you next time. Bye bye, boogers!